you wake up in the morning and you have these lines in your eyes and when you move your eyes from side to side the uh, the lines follow these lines are better known as Nieces and welcome to my channel 50 something. My name is Bernice. On this channel I give you fitness, health, and lifestyle for women over 50. So if you're a woman over 50 and that interests you, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. But don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any time I upload and come back every week for new videos. Eye floaters or these lines that show up in your eyes all of a sudden, what are they? I'm going to tell you what they are, what you should be doing about them, and what my ophthalmologist told me about them. So a few months ago, in my right eye, I woke up and all of a sudden I had some lines. They weren't too bad. I wasn't really concerned about them, and I just got used to them. Then several months later, which is maybe about a month ago, I woke up and in my left eye i had more of these lines and they're black lines of course that freaked me out i went to my ophthalmologist and she dilated my eyes and looked inside my eye she told me that what had happened is that as we're getting older there are these lines um, there's this gelatinous substance called the vitreous and it's in these collagen pretty much structures and as we get older the gelatinous substance becomes liquefied and when it becomes liquefied then the collagenous um, structures tend to clump together and then they cast a shadow onto your retina and that's what you see with these lines well it's very important she told me that when you get an onset of it or when you get more more of it that you see your ophthalmologist right away the reason why that's so important that even though it is a natural way of growing older it is important because if for some reason your retina is torn or your retina itself is detached it's pulled away then that can be a serious thing that can lead to um, losing your sight so it's important to have it checked so i had my checked she dilated my eyes had my checked and i was told that my retina was intact i didn't have a tear and usually if you do have a tear you will also see flashes of light and so if you have a combination of those you need to see ophthalmologist regardless when you have the onset of these lines you need to or eye floaters you need to see your ophthalmologist because they can rule out anything more severe happening so i went to see her she took a photograph um she examined my eyes and she said that it was the vitreous indeed and i had had a posterior vitreous detachment that is when the vitreous pulls away from the retina but my retina was still intact so she did a follow-up with me two weeks later and um after that she told me that it i just have to live with it and that's the way it is if you're getting people over the age of 60 get it more frequently if you get it when you're younger than 60 um, it usually happens to people that are nearsighted and I, um, I've trained my brain I think to just be used to it that it's become part of me if I look at something that is busy it's not as obvious let me know in the comments if you have eye floaters and what you did about them and also let me know if you did get a retina tear or an, a retina detachment and um, whether you got surgery to rectify that situation. Let me know if there are any other conditions that you've noticed that you'd like for me to cover 